Forget about acquisition. Acquisition is tertiary. The primary goal of lifting. Use it quickly. Oh, fire! Let your mind be holy. God's fire. Fans don't receive inheritance. Supporters don't receive inheritance. Inheritance is for those who are connected genuinely by blood, by covenant, by revelation. Let me repeat. Inheritance is for those who are connected genuinely by blood by covenant by revelation only a shoe will reign forever to his kingdom there'll be no end hear me i'm about to pray please believe me when i tell you life does not have to be this hard it is the bankruptcy of something on your head you have not received some of you probably if you've been part of this vision for up to one year and your life is not producing any results check your life there is something you are missing believe me believe me there is the covenant of his presence that can bring you've heard me say it that I entered a covenant with God that I would never meet a person twice for that person's life to change. You cannot come, if you come to sit down here as a fan, unfortunately, or supporters club, or well-wishers, it has to be a covenant revelation. Lord, I believe, Lord, I believe that something can come upon my life in spite of my background my lowly estate i believe that this wealth and finance thing can be settled once and for all i believe you can, you are the god of portions you can give me portions even in a strange land i believe as a man of god that something can step upon my life and ministry will no longer be a desert land i believe as a politician that i can carry a mantle that can fight for me at the gates In the next two minutes, I'm going to allow you with the Lord. Every dimension that you need to step into, I will leave you in prayer for the next two minutes. Please, I want you to cry from the depth of your heart. For some of us, it's poverty you need to end once and for all, for God's sake. For some of us, it's weakness and limitation. Politicians, this may be your chance to access superior grace that produces results businessmen here can be your chance to rise there are young men and young women saying apostle physically speaking I don't have any advantage but the God of heaven can help you pray our global family following online pray in the name of Jesus have been given to the church mandates have been given to the church for the kings to be born the man to to return to rise in strength and power from the depth of your heart. Mantles have been given to the church. Shabbat Shabbat 
Praise and worship. have been given to the church. Power has been given to the church. Grace is distributed in the church. For the sons to arise, mantles to return. The boros to arise, Samuels to rise, for kings to be born, nations to be blessed, for cities to rise with the victory of kings. Hey. Now hear me please, listen, listen, please listen, listen. You've heard people come and stand here and everybody will tell you they listen to this message, this grace called favor. I told you my story, how that Esther anointing and that favor came upon my life for some reason it is one of the hardest graces upon my life that I've seen people receive I don't know why it's easy for people to receive the prophetic receive the healing anointing but I don't know what is it about this mantle for favor that has been very difficult and yet I submit to you by God that if you do not access the genuine anointing help them please the grace for favor there are many things you cannot do in your life this world is a cruel and a wicked world i would never be able to do what god is doing across the globe today outside of the favor of god as i will tell you there are many things i do not know I'm a student myself I learn and continue to learn I learn from the Holy Spirit I learn from Scripture I learn from our fathers I learn from people with proven track record but I can tell you one thing that I understand I understand the dynamics of favor believe me when I tell you I know what it takes to compel systems and structures to open for you among the many graces you may desire as I give you one minute again to pray I want you to cry for this grace called favor Lord let it come upon my life by your mercy Yeah. 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 Yeah.
The smell of my son is like the field that the Lord had blessed. One more minute, I'm about to speak over your life. Tonight will be one service that you will not forget in a hurry. Hallelujah. 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 There are people what you need to receive is the conviction of every great man that you admire. The first inheritance that you need. Study their mindset, their beliefs their convictions number two for some of you you need the leverage of the name a compendium of the credibility the track record the value the contribution and the honor that has been accorded that name for some of you what you need are the strategic relationships and connections that provide you a leverage for your work with God for ministry for business for your career your pursuit for some of you in all honesty what you need is physical support that push could be financial could be in terms of physical estates businesses or whatever it is but for everybody here this one is not some. I can tell you this last dimension. There is a mantle. There are graces. Behind the exploits that you see in business. Behind the exploits that you see in ministry. Behind the exploits that you see in politics and governance. Behind the exploits that you see in career. More than all the physical things whether diabolically or genuinely by the holy spirit any extraordinary physical result has a spiritual component that sponsors it unfortunately many have gone diabolic but with the dignity of kingdom integrity you can stand in partnership with scripture and the holy spirit it takes more than being gifted to excel your gift must be anointed there are many gifted people who remain empty. There are many great people whose voices remain silenced because the requisite level of grace is not there. I want to speak over your life. You don't have to kneel or do whatever. Just, just stand with understanding. I came here from the depth of my heart tonight. This is part one. Part two will be on Saturday during the broadcast. Don't miss it. Call your families and call everybody to connect by faith. Listen, I wish I were not the one doing this. If you look at me physically, there is nothing in this man physically. You would be mistaken. I am not that special as a person. However, that the excellency of power may be on us. Ordinary men. Ordinary men. Helped by a mighty God. 
ordinary men not as intelligent as necessary not as eloquent not even as visionary as necessary but when that mighty God comes to protect you and invest his jealousy upon your life your life becomes nothing short of a sign and a wonder who am I your mind is so full of me mortal man in the name of Jesus I decree and declare by the power that raised Christ from the dead hear me everything that has tied you that came from your physical paternity limitations that came from your biological father biological mother or your physical territory I stand by the honor and the privilege of the apostolic and the prophetic I break you from it now help them please I break you from it now I break you from it now I break you from it now every spirit that makes easy things difficult you saw this with your father you saw this with your mother you saw this with your siblings sincerely you have not been able to break through in the name of Jesus I come by the rod of the higher priesthood and I declare in the name of Jesus I push you to the next season of destiny help that man please in the name of Jesus Christ hear me everything that has covered your glory so that you are covered nothing about you can be seen by the power that raised Christ from the dead I tear that veil right now hear me where your physical father cost you I stand by priesthood to bless you anyone by your physical descent who said it will not be well with you I stand by the privilege of the apostolic call I reverse that statement 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 anyone who said it will not be well with you in the name of Jesus by the privilege of the apostolic and the prophetic I veto that statement and I cancel it please pay attention don't be distracted the spirit that insists that you must remain poor and beggarly in spite of your hard work in spite of educational qualification or you rise up and then you go down some of you see good things but you never lay hold of it in the name of Jesus and by the power of the prophetic I decree and declare between now and the next three months step into prepared blessings 90 days if I be a servant of God I stand by this apostolic mantle in the next three months step into prepared blessings jobs you did not apply for houses you did not build I speak this by the God who called me hear me every inherited battle they fought your father to his grave they fought your mother to his grave now they will not give you peace I help them please in the name of Jesus now may the Lord of peace himself give you peace always and by all means always and by all means 
inherited financial battles inherited family battles inherited career battles they come to an end now two more prayers and we're done my god I wish God could open your eyes to see what is happening in this place. I'm hearing the month of August that there are people between now and August. Hear me. Between now and August, I stand by Bakatos Katia. Help the help her, please, so she doesn't injure herself. What could not be done throughout 2020, throughout 2021? And even till now, in the name of Jesus, I declare between now and August, step into it, step into it, step up, step into it. Let me prophesy recovery. You have lost money. You have lost friends you have lost opportunities you have lost relationships you mishandled favorable opportunities and it slipped your hand is there hope for a tree even if it be cut short the bible says at the scent of water i want to speak over your life in the name of jesus i have been commanded to bless therefore i decree and declare everything that has left your life and is not by divine orchestration I call it back now. Finances be restored. Relationships be restored. Spiritual fire be restored. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus now hear me every parent here physical parent now who is struggling with your child in one area it looks like the devil wants to wage war over your family and some of you have been depressed asking Lord is this how I'm going to die no responsible child to rise up some of you even the child the devil is fighting to make sure you don't even have the child in the name of jesus i'm speaking to our global family first and then to the body of christ no one connected to this grace will have a cause to regret over their children therefore by this prophetic word we release ministering spirits to homes to schools everywhere your child is in the name of Jesus may they come to the saving knowledge of Jesus Christ may they be transformed may they become responsible children in the name of Jesus Christ please wave your hands to Jesus and give him all the praise ah, ah, ah. Amen. Amen. We've been commanded to bless, it cannot be reversed. Amen. Amen. One more time. Let me encourage every parent if God can grant you grace I know it is not easy but if God can grant you grace use this week and speak over your children men you are the priest over your home while your wife and children are sleeping get up in the night praying in tongues and walking around the house laying hands on them tell them don't worry I'm praying for you you just keep sleeping and take authority 
over the spiritual climate of your family stand like the priest that you are and say satan thus far have you come i have drawn a line over this family you have no business over my wife my children my husband and so on and so forth in the name of jesus christ for someone your season of shame and reproach has come to an end finally in the name of jesus christ now please the said, Rudy, this war was in my bones. forget Rudy. about acquisition acquisition over is tertiary the primary Rudy. goal of lifting use it quickly oh fire. Be let your mind be holy god's fire